Welcome to Indian Laboratories Forum. Now we are learning about Clause 8.5 of ISO IEC 17025, 2017. General Requirements for the Competence of Testing and Calibration Laboratories Hope you have learned up to Clause 8.4. If not, please refer our previous videos. Clause 8.5, Actions to Address Risks and Opportunities What is risk? Risk is defined as, the combination of the probability of occurrence of harm, and the severity of that harm. The laboratory shall consider the risks and opportunities associated with the laboratory activities in order to Give assurance that the management system achieves its intended results. Enhance opportunities to achieve the purpose and objectives of the laboratory. Prevent or reduce undesired impacts and potential failures in the laboratory activities. Achieve improvement. Laboratories should identify the risk and opportunities associated with laboratory activities. Identification of risk considering the internal context, which means internal laboratory operations, and external context, which means risk related to customers, vendors, suppliers, service providers, etc. Upon identification of risk, laboratory has to assess the risk and implement the appropriate mitigation plan for improving the laboratory operations in producing the quality of results. The laboratory shall plan actions to address these risks and opportunities. How to integrate and implement these actions into its management system. Example, through revision of procedures, or, trainings, or any other suitable actions based on identified risk and implemented action for mitigation. How to evaluate the effectiveness of these actions. Example, through routine audits, internal audits, continuous review of data generated, out of action taken for the identified risks. Actions taken to address risks and opportunities shall be proportional to the potential impact on the validity of laboratory results. Example, if higher the impact on validity of results, that should be the first priority to address and take the effective action to mitigate the risk. Takeaway from Clause 8.5 Risks and opportunities should be considered to achieve its intended results, purpose and objectives of the laboratory, prevent or reduce undesired impacts and potential failures. Laboratory should have a plan for actions to address risk and opportunities and evaluate the effectiveness of those actions. Actions to address the risk and opportunities should be directly proportional to the potential impact on validity of results. Examples of non-conformances as per Clause 8.5 Laboratory has not identified the risks and opportunities, and not implemented the action for potential failures, examples risks of equipment failures, risk on impartiality, risk on confidentiality, risk on validity of results, etc. In the laboratory activities. Hope you enjoyed learning about the requirement of Clause 8.5 of ISO. IEC 17025 2017 and examples of nonconformances as per clause 8.5 Please like subscribe and click on bell icon for regular updates Thank you Happy learning